All right. Hello, y'all. Time to Dollar Tree. There's actually going to be a verb in the dictionary for it. It says Dollar Tree. All right. Well, let's check out the dad stuff. Oh, look at that. That's pretty cute. Somebody had a good idea. Oh, look, there's a couple beef sticks. You have to buy all these individually. I don't think they're selling this as a thing, but it shows you what you can do. Dad, you're the best. Oh, there's some other cute ones. Look at this one. They put a lighter, air freshener, some socks. That's cute. There's the beard trimming cape. Here's some more of the socks. Little dad stuff that's coming up. And then look, they have some little glasses. Dad bought. I prefer father figure. That's cute. This is an what an awesome dad looks like. That's very cute. And then the coffee cups. And then they have the toolboxes still. So they're getting all the dad stuff ready. This is for your car. So they go which can. A couple colors. And then there's some over here. And there's the lighters. Let's see what this is. It's soap, I think. A few little different things. Oops. Well, this is not necessarily dad stuff, but check it out. Some, oh, that's cute. Look at that. The little, it's really cute. Little hair ties and things, and then the signs down here make every minute count. That's cute, fabulous, focused, and fierce. Focused and fierce, better with friends. Oh, that's cute. And we have some lots of bags, and then on this side, more bags. There's the little Christian signs. Hope may God fill you with peace. Ooh. With all joy and peace. Bless this home with happiness and love. Walk in love, grow in peace. And I think it says something. May the blessings from heaven fill this home with love. How cute is that for somebody that's just getting into a new house or something? Looks kind of awesome. All right. And then also in the center aisles here we still have... Let's see, the bee and the uh, lemon plates and dishes and bee stuff. So I hadn't seen these here before, but I've seen them online. There they are in real life. All the little bee decorations. So, and the lemon dishes, the glasses, these are real glass and they're heavy. And that's cute, really, really nice. So, these are pretty good size as well. And then they have the, that's pretty, that's pretty heavy actually. I wonder how well it would hold up under washing. Don't know, but those look pretty nice. All right, let's move along. I have become a connoisseur of looking at their flowers when I come in here because some of them are just really, really nice. So look at that, and you get up close. That is so pretty in person. And these, I mean, I'm not good at growing plants at all, so I do like getting some of these sometimes. I have some for 4th of July that I'll keep out for a while, and then maybe I'll come get some for summertime. All right, so we're going to move along, and we're going to look at, well, I'm stopping because I see this. Not, I don't wear false eyelashes, but I like the idea of them. <laughs> Isn't that silly? Isn't that pretty? All the different kinds they have. And let's see, they're different places. Like this says Greece, that says Africa. This is Shang uh, Shanghai, Hollywood. Wow, look at that. Thailand. And they're different colors. I noticed that too. Like this one here has like a purple tinge to them. I don't know if you can see that. That's kind of nice, but not something that really says me. 
Um, I did buy this lip plumper lip gloss and it does have this little hot alert on here. Um, they're right. It is hot. <laughs> um, it uses um, the capsaicin that you see with um, peppers in there. And so that's what makes your lips plump, lips plump, if I can say it correctly. And so, you know, you could take a pepper and do the same thing, but it's not as cool. And this is a lip shea, shea butter lipstick. That's cute. All right. Well, let's move along and take a look at some things that are going on here. We're still doing summer, it looks like. Summer decorations. <laughs> Somebody put the sign upside down. Um, but there's still a lot of summer decorations. Over here we still have the flower lays, the big ice creams down there. There's your luau. And then here is the summer stuff. We have the ice cube trays. That's cute. I have a blue one and a red one already. Um, like this. Well, yes, it has it's brown holes like that. Not the square looking ones or rectangle looking ones. And so I'm still looking for a <clears throat> kitchen towel that I had found. It's kind of like that um, drawing mat, but it's a kitchen towel and I haven't found it again. So I may not, <laughs> but I want to look for that. I also want to look for some crayons and I wanted to look for some face masks to see if they have them. I've seen them online and I was hoping to find them. And then I'm trying to keep my eyes open for anything new because I might find something else I'd like to have. So let's see what else. Oh, look at that. I don't think I saw this one before. Salty and happy. I saw C's the day before. That's cute. But I didn't see that one. And they have the ribbon too. That's adorable. It's a lighthouse. So if you're really into nautical or you're doing some nautical themed something, there's some really cool stuff that will work. Look at that one. Home by the Sea. I like that one too. But I don't have anything that is this theme and don't want to do this theme right now, but it's cute if you're into that. So more silk flowers. Oh, what's this? So that's interesting with the greenery and the gold. Hmm, that's interesting. I do like, excuse me, I do like those. And then they have vases down here. They have some round ones, full ones. And then those are just more of the regular tapered. Tapered ones. And here's the graduation stuff. It's graduation's about done, I think. Or there might be some people still graduating. But on this side, we have still 4th of July, Memorial Day type stuff. I have not seen this guy, but I have a better... I bought it at Dollar Tree, but it's a better flag than that one. It's uh, wooden. It's really cute. I like it. So... But yeah, we have a lot of... 4th of July. Red, white, and blue. For 4th of July. Oh, they put out more plates. They've restocked this a bit. So we can celebrate. I wonder if more people celebrate 4th of July than Memorial Day. Probably. But, yeah, you because know, they put out a lot more stuff for that. And then here's some boxes and things for wrapping up gifts. And we're going into another section now. This is going to be, let's see, outdoor toys and summer toys and things like that. We got out. There's the bug catchers and water gun. Is that a water gun? Bubble fan. That's a bubble fan. This is a bubble flying disc. And this, oh, this, I've seen this before. This is just weird feeling. It is sticky almost. So I can't imagine filling that with water and hitting somebody with it. So they have the huge bubble ones. And this is a water squirter. And I saw a video where there were water, water squirters that looked like sharks and fish. 
I don't see those here, but do kids really care? I think they just want to play. And then this is a slam rocket. More bubble blowers. Those look like water guns, but they're bubble blowers. These are beach toys for digging in the dirt or the sand. More bubble blowers. Ooh, look at those shovels. Big shovels. Oh, and here I saw this too. Glad to see it here. It's Cookie Monster. Yeah, everybody likes Cookie Monster. And then there's some... I don't know what that is. Water squirter. Now they do have them. So you have the bubble blowers and the water squirters. And then there's the little golf tees, some balls, kites, basketball. Here's here's this guy. They're just calling it an ankle skipper. When I was a little girl, this was called a lemon twist. Oh, that one lights up. How cute is that? How cute is that? I wonder if you'd hurt yourself on this thing. Because when I was a little girl, that one's not lighting up. Hey, aren't you supposed to light up there? That one does. Make sure they light up if you're going to buy one. There we go. I, I might get one. I hope I don't get hurt on it or my daughter don't get hurt on it. But <clears throat> my daughter, uh, I mean, I, when I was little, I had a lemon twist and I busted my toe open because I was do skipping it without shoes and I hit a rock yeah rock versus toe rock wins so here's some more water squirters that look like um, squirters if I can say it right um, look like crayons and that's a water ball sling shooter okay so these are balls that you get wet and you throw them at people and splat there's some castles that look like for sand buckets for building sand castles Lots of water toys. That's just a splash toy. Um, splash ring. Let's see. There. It says four plus, so they're not going to be huge, I wouldn't think. But you know, there might be some that are a little bigger. This one is small because it's a cup holder. See, I had to really look at that that's a soda can so you, that, you can get this idea of the size of that and then here there's a child in it so this one is a neon swim ring so this is bigger and it does tell you it's 30 inches so you have to kind of read on the packages and look at the pictures to see if it's worth it here's a scuba kit snorkel is what they call it a mask and then there's the bubble juice there's several of those more um, swim masks wine disc and some goggles lots of those on this side here's baseball and bat and then on the end they put their garden gnome stuff I did buy not from here but I bought some garden gnome stuff I gotta put out I just haven't had the chance to do it yet because I'm running behind I tend to be a day late and a dollar short all the time we'll get there they have tons of Father's Day cards. They look like they're nice, right? And how much do you want to... I mean, some guys really like them, but... What does it say? He's the kind of guy who would fix anything from flat tires to bad days. He never expected anything in return, but he got it anyway. Gratitude, pride, and of course, lots of love. Happy Father's Day with admiration, appreciation, and so much love. That's cute. Aww. Dad, Father's Day makes me think of all the great times we had together. And, whoops. Whoops. And it says, Those memories mean so much, and today seems like a good time to let you know how much it means to have you for a dad. Happy Father's Day. Oh, see? And that's pretty. It's not frilly. It's not silly it's it's nice so yeah nice cards for father's job i have to get my girl to come pick out one and of course they have the wrapping paper for a gift if you want to do it that way so and then this place has seeds for growing things or this dollar tree i should say and then there's gloves and here's all of this storage bins and buckets and things like that and planters and then we've got a plethora of flippy floppies, different sizes, and some hats. Mm -hmm. 
Catch Me by the Sea. The B ones. There's some black, just plain black ones. Those are good because you don't have to worry about getting dirty and having to fix them. And then there's some over there. I think that's it's right under the Dollar Tree Plus sign. So I'm wondering, are they a different price than the ones we're looking at or not? Let's take a look and see. Yep, they're five bucks. So, but they're different. They have, they're a little thicker, of course. And they're more slides than flip-flops. So, there's that. Alright, so I'm going to head down one of these aisles. On this end cap, we have some toys, summertime toys. Looks like to me. Um, this is a great place to get cards of all kinds, including thank you cards. I bought several of these. Oh, look at that. It's cats. How cute. Thank you. Bless your heart for being so nice. Yeah. And there's just very simple. So they have a lot. And look, there's a whole aisle. And then it goes around on the other side on the end cap, too. I'm just cards. Now, one of the other things that I have bought that I'm going to use someday, but I went ahead and bought them so that I'd have them, is this um, 12 balloon sticks for standing them up. Um, because I think that they'll be helpful when I go party. And these show a picture of the balloons in the yard on these balloon sticks. You can put them on the ground. But, you know, you could probably stand them up wherever you wanted. All right, let's move on. And here's more thank you cards. Really cute ones. You could do these for your teachers easy or for anybody in your life. I mean, why not? And, of course, over there is the party section and the um, Christmas, not Christmas, but wrapping paper and all that kind of stuff. This is a great place to get those things. They have the bracelets and the necklaces that kids like to wear and stuff so there's that and then there's a whole uh toy section so i'm gonna walk through here um and see if there's anything that jumps out at me um see if there's anything really new or anything of great interest so they have a lot of these uh, this is a jurassic park one you get to color it so it's like a poster that you can fill in the coloring on and they have different ones and then they have sun catchers you can also color hang in the window those are kind of fun for kids to do for time out of school then they have all the little collectible guys I love to put those in Easter eggs but everybody does something different. Oh, I haven't seen this, I don't think. It's Play-Doh mold. Modeling clay. Oh. So you can mold things. Some cute little dollies. Hello. She's got a little strawberry dress on. Flowers. She's adorable. And then they have Barbie accessories. A lot of them. And purse play set. My daughter's a little bit old for some of this, but still nice to look because sometimes you never know what you might find and yeah, it's still interesting to see some of the toys that they have around oh yeah they have play-doh Chris and Jasmine down there they have puzzles lots of puzzles and some games. Clay. There's more puzzles up there. Yeah. Okay, we're going to move along. So here's the um, cleaning section and all the supplies. They have lots of, looks like they've restocked recently. So there's the dish soap. All brands I'm not buying dish soap today because I've got plenty right now but I thought this was nice they have the ultra detergent to packs there's 10 in here $1.25 that's too bad I do have some of the peppermint and sage dish soap this stuff does, smells wonderful and it does a great job so people have been going nuts about that one this is toilet bowl packs there's 10 in there I think that's a pretty good deal 
This Dollar Tree has the refills of the bathroom cleaner. You can find the spout and bottle for it. I found it at another Dollar Tree. I don't see it here, but you might could use your own. I mean, could you just take that and put it in like a spray bottle like this, not this one, but in a spray bottle and put water and close it up and use it. So they actually have a bottle that goes with that, but it's not here. So I don't see it, but they have a lot of good cleaning products. So I'm going to walk down this way and look for a second. So there's window cleaner, the awesome window cleaner. Totally awesome orange. Clorox wipes that they keep in the little travel packs. I do like those. They have some down here. This is good and clean wipes. There's laundry detergent. Clear. Fabuloso. Mm, kind of economy size. Okay, I had to stop and chat to another shopper. We were talking Dollar Tree business. All right, so let's see what else we can find. I'm going to go down to the book aisle, I guess. I don't want to spend a ton of time here, but they always have. Wow, this is, uh, this is my Dollar Tree book place. Like, they just always have a lot of books. Look at this. Daughter from the Dark. Wow, that's a little ominous, isn't it? Okay. And then they got kids books right next to it oh oh this was one of my daughter's favorites it's super Y. that's Hansel and Gretel wow that's cool they do a lot of um, reading books to help children learn how to read so but god grief they have so many things crosswords are up here now thinking of you just a little book as for kids they have some Christian books. They have a lot of Bibles. They have, I bought this set. This is the Creepers set. I don't have absolutely every one of those books, but they have a lot of them. Living Your Best Life, according to Nala Cat. Oh my word. Love Nala Cat. My name is Nala. You might have seen me on social media. I hold the Guinness World Record for being the most popular cat on Instagram. Huh. I've never heard of it. Are you ready to live your best life? That's what it says right there. Isn't that cute? So, oh. So what does it say? Sometimes you have to tell yourself, I'm a shark and attack the day. You know what? I think I'm going to get that for my daughter. Because she loves kitty cats and... I don't know what all it says, but I'll find out. I'm learning to read all around the world. Um, this is a cookbook, clean and healthy, made easy. Couple boy, a lost diary of Paul Wolf. Who is Paul Wolf? Shark frenzy. I mean, I could dig all day, possibly. Discovery. Wow. Some good books. Yeah. I'm not going to take a ton of time because I already got a whole bunch to read, but some are repeats. But yeah, I love looking. I love looking. Okay. Okay, still looking through. They have tons of books coloring books, math books, reading books. Just a ton of books for all ages. So I always enjoy taking a look and seeing what they've got that might be interesting. Thank you. And I did not. They also have some workbooks for kids, like Subtraction Edition, some Sudoku for adults. I forgot to look on this side. We've got lots of different t shirts and stuff. Oh, they're selling face masks still. So good to know. Here is some electronic stuff. Now this this store doesn't have a ton of electronics. They have a few. They're okay. Not a ton. Some of these things are pretty good. We charge three things at once. That might be kind of cool. And then we've got some plushies. Now we're getting in the five dollar section, so these are not a dollar and a quarter. So and these toys are more expensive too. See, 
excuse me, five dollars. But there's a little helicopter. Look at that. Interesting. And then here's five and three different pieces. They're crafting canvases. Hmm. There's some cool looking water bottles. That's kind of nice. Ooh, real glass too. And then they have the really big water bottles and tumblers. All right. A lot of decorations. Hmm. Excuse me, ma'am. And we got some more decorations for the fourth. And got the, I've got me one of those big tall guys down there already. There's socks for the fourth. And there's summertime toys. I'll look at them in a second. A lot more throws and rugs. Bins. They're really pushing these bins. Huh? They look okay, but I don't think I have a place for those or a need for them so I'm not going to indulge in that and then here's some more summertime toys wow look at this this is a whole bunch of balloons you fill with water and then you have this X shot for five bucks that's not too bad and then there's more for water balloon fights and things like that so uh, Oh, there's a big bubble maker. Now, again, these are a little more expensive. Five bucks for a lot of these. There's a badminton game, that sort of thing. They have some shorts here for five bucks and leggings. Okay, we're going to move along. Um, all right, hang on. So, they have a lot of candles always, some better than others. I do really like the vanilla one in that little jar. Um, but they have different smells in that little jar, too. They have these. They have a coconut one I like. It's the green. But there was a different kind that I managed to find a couple of that I was going to look for and see if they had. And they don't. But look, they do have some bee ones. See? There's the, the bee shape. But they're not having the other ones I was looking for. But it's okay. Let's look high. Nope, not seeing those, but they're starting to put out. So they have a 24 pack of pencils for a dollar and a quarter. That's pretty good. These are number twos. So that's pretty good, actually. They're not pre sharpened, but that's okay. And they got some markers too. All right, so we're getting down that aisle. We're going to look at all the or some there's more pencils pens and their booklets looks like they, they they had so many they were falling off the shelves they've got that down under control now not quite so many All right. so I was looking for the pencils the, the praying pencils colored pencils and they don't have them so they don't have even the smaller packs so they have the eight pack of the Crayola, which is okay, but I was looking for the deal. Yes, you can, can't blame me for looking for the deal. They do have these markers. There's 20 of them. That's pretty good. And yeah, that's more of those and more of those. They have a lot of those going on. That's a dollar and a quarter. That's not bad. So, but I'm going to pass on those for now and I'm going to keep on looking. So we're still over here in the supplies, the office supplies. They have a bunch of folders and notebooks and stuff. And they still have some of these pencil boxes, the two, um, the two layer ones that have one in and one out. Still a really good deal on those and I really do like them. Um, I have a bunch, so I'm not going to buy any. Oh, look at this. 40 erasers for a dollar and a quarter. That's pretty good. And here's huh, even more. That's 60 right next to each other. 
I guess this one has more yellow in it. That's a good deal. So I think I might go ahead and get that. My daughter goes through erasers. She just does. So I don't know if she eats them or hides them or gives them away, but they're gone in no time. So and then here's over in the, the little teacher's corner. They have a lot of, of supplies for teachers and you can use them at home too. I bought several things and used them at home and on the other side are stickers and they have such a plethora of stickers different kinds look at the butterflies those are green those are pretty haven't seen those before you could use these for a photo album a scrapbook um i used to put them in my daughter's lunch when she was going to school just for fun you could do all kinds of things with these oh look at that this is a ceramic stickers so you put these on ceramics good things are going to happen hmm, there's no real explanation there's no instructions on the back of this thing so but it says ceramic stickers so i guess you stick this on ceramics that's very interesting i didn't know they had that i might have to get this and try it just because i'm curious curiosity killed the cat yeah well, I don't think stickers are going to kill me, so, but I know they have iron-ons. You can do all kinds of things with them. Look at that. That's kind of neat. It's this family. That looks like it would be good for, for like, a, uh, we call that scrapbook. I got trolls. You see that? Trolls over there. Oh, look at this. Uh, uh, uh. Pride stickers. That is awesome. I'm so happy to see that. Dollar Tree. You go, Dollar Tree. And these are puffy stickers. Look at those. Yes, girl. Star Chaser. Spread love. Oh, that is so nice. I like that. Um, and those are just love stickers that I was looking at. But yeah, I'm really happy to see the pride stickers. I'm going to get some. Um, yeah, I am not gay. I don't really know anybody that's gay, but that's okay. I like pride. I think it's a good sentiment. I think that, you know, the if crime is loving somebody, then geez, <laughs> you know, put them in jail. I I'm joking. What I mean is, is that it is really shouldn't be a crime. Come on let people do what they need to do okay i pulled those all down ah, i want to put them all back without breaking the little thing so that they all fall down and that's hard because they're weak oh that one slid down let's see oh here it is okay so it didn't go anywhere bad 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 but they have look at that home one right there that's cute i do so much with stickers so as adults look, oh look at this doesn't that look lovely? And they're pansies. Oh, all right. I'm buying them. <laughs> and if y'all haven't seen my uh, videos before, you may not know, but my mother's name was Pansy. So I have found so much Pansy stuff. It's unreal. I just got through buying a set of these stickers at another Dollar Tree. On, oops, on one of my other videos. So, just a reminder everywhere sometimes. Okay, moving on. Okay, so around the corner they have decorations. They have little, little pictures down there. I'm not even going to look because I bought a lot and I have enough. But I do like their vases. That's new. Their glass, as you can hear. These are clear. There is a green one back over there um, these are plastic but they look good right they look pretty neat these are not glass I don't know acrylic maybe I don't know what you want to call that but it's not glass all right and then we got the dog food on this side don't need dog food I don't have a dog on the other side of me is frames 
picture frames of all kinds and then some little decor like this says hello you could use this to hold pictures um, and some you know uh, photo notebooks to put pictures in oh and there's some more there's a pink there's a pink jar I have a set of these already I don't need any more I was looking for a blue one see there's a purple one over in the back yep and that looks like blue, but it's green. I, there is a blue one, but I haven't been able to find it. So I'm missing one. I'd really like to find it. I did find a set of these and bought them. They're really nice. I haven't hung them yet, but I intend to. I like this set. All right. And there's all your fillers for vases and things like that. So, But I was looking on this side at the cat and dog stuff because... Yes, my cat could use a new toy. They can always use new toys. They just tear them up. And uh, it doesn't matter if they're a Dollar Tree toy or if they're from Walmart or somewhere else. They just get tore up because the cats have claws. And that's what they do. They chew. And they, they drag them around the house themselves <laughs> if we're not playing with them. So, uh, I think I'm going to wait one more trip before I get them anything new. So we're gonna keep on going. There's uh, rugs and hangers. I have plenty of both of those things. Oh, do, do, do. Now we're in the car section. I am on the lookout for something called get, Gunk Getter, but I've only seen it in a video. I know it probably really does exist, but I have not been successful in finding it yet. But they have other things that are really handy like this set of tweezers I have bought several sets of those to have them around because you never know when you're gonna need something like that um, and then of course you can get a lot of gifts to put in a basket for your dad for dad's day um, air fresheners car fresheners things to clean with but no gunk to get her so it looks kind of like slime but it's not slime so I'm just backing up to see if I missed it. And I did not. So on this side, we have storage containers and hangers and lights. Lots of different kinds of night lights for kids. Some tabletop lights. There's a fake security camera you put up so people won't steal your stuff off your porch. Those porch stealers are awful take your stuff these are um, phone accessories they're the little uh, holders that go in the back there's some cables and then of course the earbuds um, and then of course the styluses all right we're moving on they have a lot of hair stuff always from bows to um, hair ties to clips to headbands of all kinds some of them are really really cute look at this I think I've seen these before these are cute this little scrunchie with the fresh strawberries on it is cute and they have ones for, for like infants down there the white and pink ones so they have adult ones too but I believe this is like a baby one look at that that's so sticky cute makes me want to have a baby in oh that's cute if you're into like kind of shabby chic and then here's fancier hmm I love the clips that look like butterflies. Those are adorable. Different colors. There's Elsa. So, a lot of different ones. Hair tools. Combs and brushes and sprays. Of all kinds. And then we got bags of all kinds. And here's some more hair. Hair bands. Scarves. And this is where you'll find bananas. And then sometimes, yep, here they have them here. This is the men's premium pocket squares that are really cool to put in your pocket when you're having a suit on. Some of these are really nice. And there's some caps down there. More scarves and bandanas. So I'm still mystified by this olive oil hair mayonnaise that I saw one time. And it is here again. And I just... I don't know, I can't imagine putting mayonnaise in my hair 
even if it is good for it. I mean, I guess it's a deep conditioner. It says strengthens damaged hair, which is definitely mine. Excuse me. I do have some bath sponges. This is two for a dollar and a quarter. And they're in a sealed bag. They have a couple of them. It's kind of cool to have. You need to swap these out pretty regularly. And I always feel weird about not just the Dollar Tree, but anywhere that has the sponges that are just out. So I kind of like the idea of them being in a sealed baggie, like the masks. Um, and what do we got here? Shower cap. Just like the shower cap is um, sealed. I hope this might be the one that I bought my daughter. There's one that's lined that's really cool. So that's that one I'm going to hold on to keep an extra one around because she uh, got the purple one she's about there got the purple one because she likes that oh look see here's some more and actually green is my color so I'm going to swap this around the blue one. I still have not found that exfoliating um, sponge that I found that I like so much I've not seen anything like it ever again so here are some more shower caps, but these are tiny, and I doubt these have the liner, but there are three in there, so that's a benefit. And then you have some more shower caps that's 10 in a bag, so those are 10 in the bag. And then you have some of these hair wraps that have um, coconut oil in them, and I saw a doctor actually do a YouTube video about these very things. And she talked about how she wraps her hair in them when she gets out of the shower. And it basically takes all the water of her hair. And it's almost dry by the time she takes it off. So, um, yeah. I don't know. Maybe I should get one to try it for my hair. I mean, I'm sitting here talking about it. Why haven't I done that yet? I don't know. Because I'm worried that she was talking about something a little different. And it's worth a shot, right? It's a dollar twenty-five, And it's right here in my face. And, uh, yeah. How wrong could it be? I mean, what's the worst that could happen? Pull out the rest of my hair? Ha ha, no. Anyway, so, yeah. All right, so we're gonna move along here. And on this side was the cleaning products. I didn't mention that. We have lots of different cleaning cloths. This one I don't think I've seen. It says Clean Life Multi-Purpose Cleaning Cloth. You get two in there, that looks pretty good. I have one of these guys. And look at this, they actually have the real, not knockoff, but that's the real Mr. Clean. It's only one pad in there, but if you really want that guy, he is here. They do have a knockoff one somewhere around here. Uh, here it is. And you get two in there for a dollar and a quarter. So, up to you which one you think would be better. And there's some Brillo pads and all that kind of stuff. I have plenty of that stuff right now. So, yeah. All right, we're going to move along. Okay, so I did see um, a TikTok video that talked about the Irish Spring Bar Soap. And they have it. There's that. And there's one down here. You're supposed to use this to shave it up and put it in like a little vase and put it outside and it, it keeps flies away. So I think that's interesting. But you could also, instead of buying the sachet bags, maybe you don't like those. The smell of the lily something and the other one that's white rose. You could use one of these, these soaps. You could put it in your drawer and it'll help make everything in there smell like the soap, which is clean and fresh smelling. So you have such a variety to choose from. Um, same doctor that I saw did a review of these. And again, she was a skin doctor. So she was a big proponent of these. Said these were a good idea. So they are the collagen, vitamin C, and hyaluronic acid body lotions. I've started using one of them. I think it was the hyaluronic acid. I do like it. It's um, light and smooth and absorbs very quickly. So I do like that. Oh, look at this. Moisturizing conditioner. Oh, this must be for hair. But it says strawberries and cream. Yeah, that smells like strawberries. That's awesome. All right, we're gonna move along. I've not seen this. It's cocoa butter formula 
length retention two-step hair mask hmm. with biotin cocoa and butter and biotin interesting so this is new here too we got mushroom complex and turmeric and super probiotics and b12 extra strength those are some new vitamins I don't see a lot of vitamins otherwise so in the makeup section we have our usual nail kit I see nail polish remover which I oh, haven't seen that in a little while and they have this little container down here you could put it in I've got one of these you put your nail polish in here and then you just kind of flip the top and then it pumps out it's really cool keeps you from wasting too much of it or spilling it because some people don't really like the smell of nail polish remover I know my dad never did so and then they have just a ton of nail stuff which we gotta love that right because we can pick and choose excuse me I'm gonna take a deep dive for a second and see if I see oh look at that that's amazing it looks like butterflies and behind it they have these and then there's those like a brown oh and orange wow and then even on top the pyre they have the easter egg ones different brand Ooh, look at that one the easter eggy ones oh, those are nice flowery ones wow I was looking for something specific though. They're called kissables and they were different ones, but I don't see those. I do see these and these. And then they have the nail gems. Um, that's just the makeup mirror. We have the cooling mist and lotion. Women's health and wellness. Soothing body lotion gel. Apply and completely absorb water glycerin and it has methyl paraben in it so I don't think I would go with that one I'm supposed to stay away from parabens I don't know if that means all parabens or not just that one <clears throat> so I'm going to come back this way and take a look, a look. <sighs> they've got some nice tweezers Wow, those look like they'd be easy to hold. I like that. I like the different color too. Usually they're just silver. But they have those. These are mini tweezers. Not sure what you would use that for. Oh, look. Yeah, I found some of these the last time I was in a Dollar Tree and I bought a pack. I haven't used them. Um, they do have different colors though. Not here. These look like they're all the same color. But I have seen videos of showing multiple colors of those, which is kind of cool. So, and then I think I showed these on another video. They still have these, the little silicone toppers and the different colors. Um, Beauty Intuition, that's got pineapple on it. And this is the strawberry silicone topper, bright color, matte finish grade formula nail polish good for you so yeah okay let's um let's move along for a second so i don't know this brand but that is a huge bottle 16.9 fluid ounces of nouvelle intense body care lotion it's for dry skin so yeah i'm gonna have to look them up and see what kind of deal that is is there anything and there we should be overall like, concerned with. No, there's not. That's good. Oh, hang on a second. 